Hello, welcome to this daily t-shirt design video. My name is David Samoje. I'm here with you with another t-shirt design. And this is going to be a Canva t-shirt design. Yes, today is Friday and it's a good day to make a new design for you guys. It's the weekend. Hope you guys are doing good. Hope you are not allowing the situation get to you guys. I just really want to appreciate you guys for what you guys have been doing. You guys have been amazing. You guys have been really, really amazing. You guys have been doing really well. I hope you guys are safe. Please stay safe. Don't stress out. Don't freak out. It's going to be a good time. Please, if you've just joined me for the first time and you're here to subscribe, please, I would advise you to subscribe. We have about 289 subscribers. Let's get to 1K at the end of May. Let's get to 1K. So without wasting much of the time, I'm going to go straight into Canva and open Canva.com. I'm going to be using Canva.com for this design. It's going to be a motivational design for this period. So it's going to be a text-based typographic t-shirt design for this period. So we're going to go straight into it to create a design, custom dimension, 4, 4, 500 by 5, 400 pixel it's pixel so it creates great design so with this design we're going to start with shapes then we go into words so to start with shape we go to element so i'm just going to bring in these four shapes I'm just going to bring in this so this will be the first one to be the first one so i'm going to duplicate this i'm going to duplicate this so it's going to be then to duplicate it all you have to do is to press on your alter key button your keyboard your left mouse key button and drag to whatever size you want it to be so this is how this one is going to be so i'm going to reduce this i'm going to reduce this This is how I want this to be. So this is going to be like this. It's going to be like this. So now I'll just, you know, just turn it a bit. Just turn it a bit. So we have it like that. So now I'm just going to change the colors. So to do that, I'll click on it. Come over to this. This here, I can make it. Just going to make it a kind of blue. Yes, that was, uh, that's okay. For this. For this, I'm going to make it um, red. And for this. No, make it white. No, I can't make it white. So, it a darker gray. So I can put a white on it. So now uh, the colors don't seem to match well, but make it. Um, let me just find the color. Say orange. Okay, this is cool. So now that we have that, so the next step. Next step is for me to just add. Okay, so I just saw something here. I just saw something here. I want to add. Just saw something here. I want to add. So you can see Canva has some elements. You can just based on trends and all. Is based on trends so this is okay so but i'll just shift this to the side while i fix in my fixing my text so this one is going to say it's going to say I won. I'm gonna say I won. 
they'll make it a little bit bigger so that we can place it um, into this we place it into this and for this for this it's gonna be yes I did not mention it because it's gonna get me YouTube against this so for this last one it's gonna be just adjust it about the last one so I'll reduce this a bit turn it because you know we're trying to fix it into this box so just turning it and making sure it fits fit into this box we'll just turn it a bit you can see so now oops sorry about that let's increase this so Okay, so now have that we can now bring in our we can now bring in our image. So I like it the way it is right about now. So now what will I do next? Now this is the design. This is the way I want the design to be. So all I'm gonna do now is to save it remember this is a free version of canva pro so i can't save with the white background but if you stay tuned i'm gonna show you i'm gonna show you how to get rid of the white background in photoshop so if there's something you're interested in make sure you stick around so you just click on save and download sorry just click on download so it's gonna download now we go to show folder to show image so this is our design so we'll just click on it open in photoshop open in photoshop so in photoshop now we're going to remove the um white background sorry about that just stretching my body so now we're going to remove the white background to do that you come over click on this create new layer it's gonna create extra layer so now you click on this layer zero way you have your design you go to this magic wall tool it's like a magic stick if you've been following me you know this tool already click on it and you click once on the white just click once on the right white to get rid to get rid of the white so you click on delete so now you've noticed that for the nurse for the man's shirt it has taken the white away but now it has also created um, a kind of effect so this kind of effect now depending on the shirt it's on it's going to determine what this man's overall is going to be like what his medical garment is going to be like so i hope you get the drill so now that we have that we just move this around move it a bit so we have it placed in the middle and now we can just save this save as with pictures I won okay so now we have that we have that we just save it want to save it as PNG very important because we don't want the white background so you save it as PNG save it as PNG and always make sure you cross check when you're done saving make sure you always cross check as you can see it's just about nine minutes into this design so now we just go to pictures again now that we have the design saved just look for i1 so this is it says i1 so you can see it has created that effect it has created that effect we want so now we just go to uh, mock-up i have my mock-ups I have my mock-up so I'll just click you, you already know I have this anger mock-up I love to use it's super easy to use without wasting much of the time we just go to 
um, your design here you click on it click on it so now that we have that we delete this two already then we'll bring in our design bring in our design um, I want so this is it we'll just drag it into the space now that we drag into this we want to reduce it so to reduce it to over mouse to this edge press down three buttons are of alter key button shift up kick button left mouse click button and drag inwards to reduce outward to increase inward to reduce so we want to drag it inwards and when we are okay with it we just press enter then we'll go back to file and save very important now it's going to show on our shirt as you can see it's going to show on our shirt so for this I want to change the color of the shirt so I'll just double tap where it says t-shirt black double tap and now I can just change the shirt to whatever color I want and just change the shirt to whatever color I want so now that we have that all set and done we just click on ok and then we'll save it as png again save as pictures by one we we'll just save this as we we'll save it as PNG. Okay, and save. It took us about eleven minutes to get this done. Not super complicated. To your right, you see a playlist. Make sure you watch intensively those videos if you want to learn creative T-shirt design. And definitely, I will see you on Monday with a new video. Stay blessed, one love.